Karen McCullough with another lesson from the road and today I'm going to piggyback on my session I did last time on Bob and Dave when we were talking about sales. What we discovered with millennials is that many of them, especially the ones that are in sales, lose their confidence. Uh, start to lose confidence. You know, they're out there, they're trying to make the sale and as soon as they get a no or a rejection, they stop. They don't pursue it. So I thought today what I would talk about is mastery. For me, mastery is something that's been a part of my whole life. You see, my dad, Mike, was not a professional golfer, just a really good golfer. And I would see my dad come home and practice. He would have a little box in our backyard and he would do nine iron chip shots. And then he would have me come out and do them and we would practice and practice. Great shot. No matter how good his score was, he was always practicing. And my dad taught me the art of mastery. So you see, with mastery comes confidence. Confidence is that ability to take a risk and to go do something. But confidence just doesn't come naturally. You see, confidence comes from experiences. The more we put ourselves out there, the more experiences we engage in, the more our confidence grows. So when people tell me they want to be a speaker, the first thing I said is go out and do 100 speeches and then come back and talk to me. I never see him again. Because most people don't want to put in that energy towards experience. So practice is the basis of growing experiences that grow our confidence. So you say, okay. 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 Practice. I've got to wake up early. I've got to practice. I've got to practice my speeches. I've got to practice talking to people. Get out of bed. There'll be no more napping. Wake up. Yeah, you got to practice. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So how does that happen? It only happens through commitment. You have to wake up. Get out of bed. Wake up. Every day, committed to push yourself to Bonk. practice, to grow those experiences, to grow your confidence. And where does commitment come from? It comes from the beginning. It comes from a vision of you seeing yourself successful. You've got to have a vision of you seeing yourself working, seeing yourself hitting that golf ball. For me, as soon as I started speaking, my vision was seeing thousands of people clapping and laughing. I started with the vision, and then I had to practice the art of mastery. So I've given you the steps. Now all it's going to take is you making that commitment to master the art of whatever it is that you want to do. I'm Karen McCullough with another Lesson from the Road.